Well, folks, we got a heck of a show for you. We uh, had some really cold weather here at the end of February that stiffened up our ice in central Vermont and uh, had some buddies come over, Al Sands, Ollie, Katie, uh, Will, Bill Perry, and uh, hit Lake Maury and the upper end of the Connecticut and some setbacks and had some real good action. The ice is probably seven to eight inches thick and um, but it'll probably be not safe after March 3rd. So these are our last two days of the season, we figure, and uh, had some pretty good luck. So I hope you enjoy this video. Here on camera, <laughs> Ollie's got his first northern, we think. If he wants to go, you let line. Just, yeah, just keep it, ten just keep tension on it. But get ready to feed some elk because he's gonna he's gonna peel more out. Keep it tight. Play by play. It felt like a ten pounder. Come over here. There's his head. Oh look at the size. Let him go, let him go, let him go, let him run. There you go. Get your face. I can't even see you. Is he still pulling on it? Sort of. Tugging? Line, you're stepping on your line. Now I'm gonna get let him just let him sit there for a minute. Right there. Holler to Al. Okay, we're gonna try to get him out of here this time. Let's see if we can get him up in the hole. Ooh, he's a big guy. Come on, open up. See what I'm doing? Yep. I'm putting my finger right here where there's no teeth. Uh -huh. oh, oh, oh. <laughs> but Put your finger right where mine is. Got it in there? Yep. Just slip, slip it up in there, not too far. You got it? Yep. Okay. Nice. Now hold him out. Hold him out. Oh. Hold him out this way towards me. What is he's a seven, eight pounder. Nice. Happy? <laughs> <laughs> Got a treat for you today. We got out here just at daybreak and we're gonna, gonna set back in northern Vermont on the Connecticut River and we're gonna set up for walleyes. We got a half moon right overhead now, just breaking daylight. Then we're gonna try to get into some slabber perch with my buddy Willie. We'll see how it goes. Buddy Willie's gonna give you a few tips on there's uh with a flasher and jigging these jumbo perch here. We said the heck with the tip ups and they're hitting the jigs good. You can see the bottom down there about 15 feet. You can see a fish coming. There's my jig right here. There's a slabber. Look at that fish. What do you mean? Yeah. You see, you gotta be at 11, 11 incher. Oh yeah. The beauty. Hold him up. There we go. Cool. We got action again. Willie's got something on his tip up here. My antique tip up. Oh, it's a big one. What is that? Give him a no shot way. of that tip up. 
We, the antique. We gotta get the fish first. Uh -huh. In case he gets off. Oh, we're at the leader. Where is he? Oh. Oh, big northern. Oh, he's got a good northern on. I, I got six pound mono on <laughs> here with a bear hook. Six pound. You got a northern, good northern. They got to be over. Th oh, see him, see him strip the line out. Look at him go. <laughs> I wonder if he's gonna be bigger. Bigger than yours? I don't know about that. that was I don't know about that, but. March 2nd, we're having a pretty good day here. Caught just about one of everything. Got a uh, little pickerel here, and I'm gonna. Um, get Willie's, Willie's got a good fish on here. See what he. Look at the size of that perch. Hold on. You didn't get him out of there, Willie. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> he popped right off. <laughs> All right. We're jigging here. I'm going to sit back and just got to keep her walleye. I can keep three under 15 and one over 18. Got them on a Swedish pimple here. Jigging for moving, jigging for perch. The first one was double. the first one was in a the first one is, is in the slot limit. I had to throw him back. He was 17 inches long, but this one here is under 15, so he's gonna go with the pail. Well, it's what is it, March 2nd? Well, probably the last ice of the last day, and um, we got. Nice, nice bass. Yes. Right around 50. One, one walleye that we could keep, one we let go, some northerns and pickerel, a little bit of everything. But five inches of ice, and I think it's going to be all over after today, March 2nd. Our last.